Hi guys, welcome back to the vlog. Today has been a long day, but I just wanted to pop in and say hi. Um, see, any updates? No updates. Um, oh, I can, I'll show you that. But I did get my Amazon order of my uh, coasters that I ordered. But I ordered this stuff. It's called the Barkeep or something like that. And it's supposed to like miraculously clean like the bottom of pans and keep like your white sink white. And it was supposed to come. But I'm starting to think it got delivered to my mailbox I don't know I don't know anywho my whole day has been thrown off because I was supposed to start the work on my bathroom but that didn't happen um so yeah so I got these coasters because I thought they were so cute so they have like gum feet here and as you see I forget what this is called like the diamond cut glass so you sit this down and you sit your coaster on top of it it comes with a set of four and they were all they're all like individually wrapped okay so see and then it comes in this so you sit this on your table and then people can just grab their cup holders so i thought this it was super cute. I will link it down below in case you guys are interested. But it's just super cute and lightweight. <clears throat> if I recall, they were really reasonably priced. So I'm going to sit these on the table. And let me show you guys. I'm pretty sure I didn't show you. If I did, I apologize in advance for showing repeat things. This is the shower wall. Um, I don't like dealing with actual grout. It disgusts me. So the good thing about these shower walls is it has the grout look without actually being grout. And then it, this one has like a huge little shelf that I can sit stuff on. And you can actually put tile, like a mosaic tile or something, in that inner part. The part that says 13 inches or 13 feet, whatever. You can actually put something in there. And then... Here is the tub, um, American Standard. They have pretty good reviews. You can't tell, but it's like a curved tub. So, flooring is there. And I actually am going to Miami this week. Um, and of course, I'll take you guys with me. I'll be vlogging it or whatever, but I... <laughs> I leave for Miami Friday, so I was kind of hoping that all of this would be done so that I could come back to my bathroom being done. Um, I come back Tuesday, so I'll be going Friday to Tuesday. And yeah, I think more than likely when I come back, I'm still going to be kind of dealing with the whole bathroom situation, but whatever, it's, so is life. Um, I don't have that much food in my house, but I didn't want to grocery shop because I won't be here and yeah, so I need to pack, but I also need to wash up like underwear, trinkets, clothes and things like that. But unfortunately, um, the, um, the power's been going out. Okay. Hold on. Un momento, por favor. My bad. I had to take that call. Um, so this is cranberry juice with a splash of pickle juice. If you never tried it, it's so good. It's so good. 
we've been having blackouts. I've had four flickers today and an outage one night. And then it came back on in like 30 minutes. So I kind of want to wash a load, but hey guys. So today has been a pretty chaotic day. Um, I tried to do my TSA pre-check and that didn't happen. So we will try again. I'm going to get clear. It's like this, um, it's like this program you can get where you kind of like skip to the front of the line or whatever. So we'll see how all that pans out. Um, I did not want to grocery shop before I left, but I kind of had no choice. I'm only going to be gone um, Friday through Tuesday. So that's like literally like a long weekend. And I don't want to come back and then have to like figure out basics. So I just got like the little stuff, you know? So, um... You know what? I don't even want to show y'all these because I feel like they already be sold out. But this is, um, it's like a ramen, <clears throat> but it's vegan. And uh, it tastes so good. It's so good. Everybody that I give one to, they like it. Um, my boyfriend likes to take them for like work and like if he gets in really late. So he asked me to buy 20 and don't trip, he will fully donate to, he will pay for all of the groceries, but he asked me to get 20 and I'm like, I'm not getting 20. You do not need all that sodium. So I got two, three, four, seven of those. These are really cool too. I don't know if you guys have ever tried these before, but it's like ready pasta. It's fully cooked in this bag. You pop it in the microwave for like 60 seconds and then you add sauce. You could also just add like a little bit of butter or vegan butter and then like salt and pepper and you're done you're done so um and then i just got a can of chili because sometimes it's just easy <clears throat> i freaking love these morning star corn dogs but they only come four in a bag so i guess i could buy more but and my boyfriend loves cheese and crackers, so I just got him this little wine-infused salami and some pineapples because your girl loves her fruit. And then these are extra sweet mini ears of corn. And I was like, okay, that just looks really interesting. And it has an option to cook them in the microwave. So I don't know if that's nasty or not, but we're going to find out. Then I don't want to have dishes before I go. So I just stop back up. Oh, trick it. I stopped back up on my paper plates. And Stoke always sells out. Um, but my shopper showed me that they had pumpkin. So I was like, okay. Oh, uh, it says creamed. What are you creamed with? What are you creamed with? Uh, it's creamed with milk. Fucking A. Okay, well, that's why I bought a backup. So, and then just some juice. I think that's it. Oh, I got a big case of my water that I like. And my creamer and my milk. So, that was about it. Not a huge grocery haul. Literally, just the small basics to get me through my morning coffee to, for tomorrow and um that's about it um i will show you guys the bathroom but let me put all this stuff up all right guys here is the update this is the drywall um let me show you what we have so far so we have majority of like the walls and stuff down um and the tub is in i will not see anything else besides this oh wow that is all new too um i won't be seeing anything else because 
I will actually be leaving for Miami. So, this is the last glimpse I will see before I come back on Tuesday. So, we are finally getting somewhere. Um, I anticipate with no issues or no problems that um, when I come back on Tuesday, everything will be done. Um, only thing I might need to get is the baseboarding, but I think I'm going to let my boyfriend handle that while I'm gone. Um, oh, uh, you guys can't really see, but I got a curved tub. So what that does is instead of the tub being like this or like that, it's like that. So it gives you uh, more space. And then I ordered a curved shower rod to be mounted because I don't like doors. I feel like I never can get like the tracks clean. So I can never get the tracks clean. Um, I'm trying to prop you guys up. I can never get the tracks clean, so it freaks me out. The freaking weather in Miami is gonna be so weird. It's 89 with 60% chance of rain. And yeah, it's like, okay. Yeah, there's like so much dust and debris around the house that I'm definitely gonna have to get the house clean. So I'm thinking what I'll do is I'll try to get it cleaned. I'll see if my housekeeper can come like Wednesday or something. I don't know. I did all that to make a bowl of cereal that I no longer want. But I'm just packing, guys, and starving, and I have to run to my P.O. box. So that's what we'll do. So we're back. Whew, child, I had so much stuff. Um, so I ordered some stuff from American Eagle. No denim. It's like they expanded their plus and then they went back down to a 20. I don't know what that's about. So, whatevs. So, I got a couple of like these little t shirts. So, they're like oversized crop tops, but they're kind of short. I like to like wear these around the house or like with like my little bell bottom pants. So I got brown. Like a beige color. And then this little greenish color. Um, they were originally $24.95, but they were on sale for $11. So, let's see. Okay, so, <clears throat> here you go. This is the shirt. Goes down pretty low in the back. Far enough for me. And it doesn't lift. So, exactly what I wanted. Might end up taking one to Miami. Okay. Then, um, I saw this ad on Facebook for this company called Cheek Boss that apparently claims to have some of the most comfortable underwear. And they have this thing where you get two free pair. So... I said, why not? Let's see if they actually come. And they did. So, I will let you guys know. Actually, I will let you guys know what I think about this. But, I mean, they're free. So, I'll link it down below. So, 
these are the first pair and as you can see they do the whole skims wide crotch thing these are look at this it's weird um so these are the no-show boy shorts and as you see there's like barely a seam so i like these so far we like them. <clears throat> they have all types of crazy 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 pants and designs i got yellow because i love yellow i love that color yellow but then i said hey let's get a little let's get a little crazy so we have these they seem like they are cooling and stretchy and all of that. Pretty sure I got these all in the same size. Got them in the 3X. So, we'll see. Cool, cool, cool. And then, right now, I'm trying to decide what I want to do because I have this big Bertha package um, that came from a company I'm doing a collaboration with that is starting a denim line. So I want to say they sent me I want to say they sent me one of each like pair of jeans so have to ask myself do I want to do that tonight because I leave in the morning and then I can edit it I don't know if I'll even get around to editing it while I'm on my trip but if I do I can send it for approval while on my trip and then it could be up as early as Wednesday but the only issue with that is I feel like it's still not really fall fall to people and I'm maybe jumping the gun by like a week and that by waiting a week it might serve better so I don't know. So that's what we're trying to decide right now. Um, I got a lot of good questions for the q and A. I I posted on um, Instagram and YouTube that I was doing the Q&A and to ask me some questions. Um, I got quite a bit, actually. I'm happy, though, because I was worried I wasn't going to get any. But, yeah, I got a good amount. So I was like, hmm. Should I try to film that today? Decisions, decisions. I feel like if I get packed all, like almost all the way and it's early, I'll do a late night like filming sesh. Like when it cools down. Cause we're in the middle of a heat wave in California, if I haven't mentioned that. We're in the middle of a heat wave. So temperatures are getting as high as 106. And we just not used to that. So today was a scorcher. For real, for real. But I will check up with you guys.